Hey guys, here we are. I'm going to do a drawing video and um, Rooka will not be drawing, but I will be drawing him. I thought I'd have him on the table with me while I did a picture. Um, you know, I always say how you should uh, use real life pictures and photos and stuff to draw. You can also reference your own pets as well if you want to learn how to draw them. He may not stay still, but we will try. Okay, so, are you ready for this rocker? He's just like wandering off. Um, let's turn the camera a little bit more so we can sort of get him in the shot. Right, so here he is. Move that up slightly. There we go. Hopefully this will work. I was a bit worried about him sort of wandering out of the shot. Right, so guinea pigs are actually really easy to draw. You've got the eyes. And they've got cute black eyes, as you can see. And the eyes are on either side of their head. And the reason that the eyes aren't on the front of their head is because they're prey animals. So the guinea pig, he can see all the way around either side. So he can see where um, predators are going to come at him from either side. They can't see, sort of, there is a tiny little gap in the very front of their nose. You can't see because his head is turned away right now. But um, they actually have this all-round vision so that they can watch out for predators. Whereas predators, they have their eyes on the front of their heads because they hone in on their prey. That's a lovely bottom rooker. So here we go. We've got his eyes. Like that. Let's colour them in. He's decided to just face away from the picture. Oh no, he's turning back round. You're okay there, Rooker. He's like, I don't know why you've put me on this table. What's going on? <laughs> right, okay. So we'll draw on his nose. And his little face. Little mouth there. And then the sort of head of a guinea pig is quite a simple shape. It sort of goes around. He's got his ears coming down here. Like that. And chubby cheeks, because guinea pigs are quite chubby animals. You also may or may not know that in Peru they eat guinea pigs. And the wild guinea pig, the type of guinea pig they eat is called a quee and they keep them just running around their floors and then they pick up one when they feel hungry and they eat it obviously they cook it first but he's giving my finger a little lick now he wants to eat my finger so let's make that fluffy bit on his bum as you can see put the camera back he does have a bum mohawk there I've been drawing guinea pigs for years. I've actually kept guinea pigs since I was 13. And I used to show them. Um, they have four toes at the front. And they have three toes at the back. And they don't pick up their food in their feet to eat it, like rats or mice. They just kind of sit there. There we go. There he is. Get him his little marking on his face. Kind of goes down like that. And then he's got white around here. Kind of goes like that. And all down here. Like that as well. And there you have it. It's Rooker. I tried to make this one quite quick because, oh, I'll, I'll do his whiskers as well, because I have whiskers. I tried to make this one quick because, obviously, I don't want Rooker being bored or getting upset or scared. So, there he is and his picture counterpart. Just put the camera down so you can see it a bit better there. And that is drawing Rooker. Not sure as he really helped very much, but I kind of with his help. 
So I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you want to check out more videos, you can click the boxes that come up below. And uh, if you want to check out my Etsy and Monday stores, feel free. I do custom plushies and also art commissions as well. Or you can buy me a coffee on Ko-fi because it all helps. Links are all, as usual, in the description. So that's all from us. Stay safe, stay healthy, and keep being awesome. This is Silverwolf and Rooker, signing off.